A teacher has sent me this 3D model, which you can see is uh, a sweep, and they've asked if they can do a fillet between these two sketches. So what you can see here is I'm just going to turn the sketches on, right click and visibility on both of those sketches. So you can see they've got sketch one and sketch two, and what they actually want to do is create a fillet between these two parts here. Now you can't actually fill it between two 2D sketches, so what you would need is a single 3D sketch. So what you can do is you can create a 3D sketch from scratch, but if you've already got two 2D sketches existing like this, I'll show you the quick way of doing it. So I'm going to go up to where it says start 2D sketch, you go on to the down arrow, start 3D sketch. Now what you can do in here is very, very similar to project geometry, you've got this button here, include geometry. So what you can do then is you can actually select all the geometry that is from those two 2D sketches. So you can see I'm just clicking on them all, going all the way through, make sure I get all of them through in these fillets. And then what you can you can't quite see because of where the model is. I've actually now got that full full wireframe. So if I'm going to finish that sketch, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to delete the sweep just so you can. I'm going to this box here is saying, do you want to delete all the sketches that are consumed by this sweep? I'm going to untick that because I don't want them to be. So you can now see I have this yellow 3D sketch. So what you can do is go back into there, just so I can show you. So edit 3D sketch, right click. And in here you've got something called bend. At the moment it's bolted to 5, so I'm going to change the 10mm so that it matches these radiuses. And then what you can do, the same as a fillet, you can just go down here and you can select those and you can now see I've got this filleted edge. I'm going to finish sketch. You can still see the other two sketches there. And then this time when you go to sweep, it obviously picks up your profile automatically and just select that curved edge and you can now see it goes round. So although you can't actually fill it between two sketches, you can create a 3D sketch from those 2D sketches. I'm just going to click on these two sketches, turn the visibility off and there you have the completed product.